Hi guys, welcome to a new video. If you are new to our channel, my name is Renee and thank you so much for clicking on today's video. Also, if you are new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and click on the little bell icon so you'll be notified every time we post a video. So today's video is going to be an, un an unboxing. I can't talk. Today's video is going to be an unboxing. I don't usually do these because I don't usually order stuff online but nothing is open because of the quarantine and all the stay at home orders so i got some stuff online i caved yes i bought stuff online and i didn't buy that much i only got like four or five things but i'm super excited about all the things i bought so i thought i would make a video of it and share it with you guys so the first thing i got or the first thing i want to show you guys is i pretty much got these all at the same time I have an order from Ulta and an order from Ugg and I'm telling you guys, I'm super excited about each of these. So I got the Clinique Acne Solutions Clearing Kit from Ulta. They are just like mini trout size. It came with all three, it came with a cleansing foam, a clinical clearing gel, and the dramatically different moisturizing gel. I actually really wanted to try this. I was gonna buy this as like a mini size one time but then just went with something else but I have had a lot of acne like around here and a lot of scarring and this had the best reviews for the most like affordable product that came with all three things to try so you'll know if they all work for you or not instead of buying like them separately or buying huge ver versions and just spending all this money but yeah these had the best reviews for stuff that would clear up acne scars and like hormonal acne around your chin area because that's pretty much the only place I really get acne unless my skin hates me one day and I just start breaking out everywhere. But yeah, so I'm excited to try these. Open it up. Okay, so I mean they are pretty good sizes for like a mini version. And then this is the gel. Oh, good. So this is the gel, it's kind of tiny, but I'm pretty sure you don't put that much on at once, yeah. Apply a thin layer to face twice a day after cleansing, and then I read that this lasts most people like maybe a month. And then this is the gel, which is the moisturizer. Yeah, so this is for a combination to leave skin, which is pretty much what I have. Sometimes my skin is dry, but it's mostly a combo. And then sometimes I get kind of oily around this area. The next thing I bought from Ulta was a ColourPop liquid liner. I got it in white. I've actually been really wanting a white liner. And I got an email from ColourPop saying that they're not shipping anything out anymore. I believe that's what it was. So I figured I might as well just get it in my Ulta order. And here it is. I haven't tried this out yet. So let's see how this looks. Where should I put it so you can see? Let's see. Super white. Oh my gosh. I am so excited. To try this on. Maybe I'll try it on in this video. Oh, well, it's weird. I don't know if on, but really gotta cap it. Okay. Anyways, the next thing I bought from Ulta, which is also the last thing I got, was what I'm in, what I'm most excited for. It is a Morphe palette. So this is the 18S palette. I saw it in the Mo Morphe store um, like a month ago. Yeah, like a month ago. And then I had already paid for all my stuff, so I only saw it like when I was walking out and obviously didn't get it. I didn't really go and try it on, but I just remember it was super pretty looking in person. So I got it online at Ulta with the rest of my purchase. I haven't even opened it, so it's gonna be like kind of first reaction. You're ready. This is so pretty. This is pretty much exactly how I imagined it would look, except I didn't realize this color had a little bit of shimmer in it, which it does. But this is just so pretty for summer. I will just watch some of the really pretty colors in this video, but let me show you guys my last package first. I lost the clear part. Oh, here it is. And then, my last purchase in this video is from UGG. I got the super fluffy sandals that they have. And I'm so nervous to try these on. I got the kid size 
because I tried on the adult size six in person one time and I didn't really like how it fit. They just looked really big. And then I realized that the kid size had a little smaller of a chunky heel. So I just hope they fit because I was hearing mixed things about the sizes. So I got this color. It has pink, white, gray, purple, and then the same pink that's all around. Oh, God. I've been wanting these for so bad, you guys, but I've always been super nervous about getting them in line. I mean, online. See, I can't talk. I've been messing up so much in this video, but I used to start like the whole sentence over again, but I'm not gonna do that anymore. I'm just gonna be me, and if I mess up, then that's fine. I'll just repeat myself. Anyways, I was super nervous to get these online. So when I try them in, try them on in store that one time, and I realized I didn't really like them that much, but then I saw that the kid's size doesn't have a super chunky heel. Like the adult woman's size has a chunkier heel at the end, and I wasn't really loving that, loving how it looked on my foot. I've seen people wear these in person and they look super good on them, but for me, I didn't really like it. So I decided to get the kid's size, and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna try this on. Please fit, please fit. <gasps> They fit perfectly, I think. They're so cute. Um, so yeah, they fit really good. I was gonna get a size five. I didn't even mention that, but these are a size four in kids. I was gonna get a size five, but then I saw people were saying that they're a little big to size down because there was a bunch of other reviews on there of people who got kid size instead of the woman size. So I know, I know I'm not the only one and I think they're cheaper. They're for sure cheaper but I don't know how much cheaper. I think these were $65 and the adult ones might be $100. That is a big saving. So if you can fit into the kids one, buy them. And then again, for reference, I'm a size six in women's and I bought them in a size four in kids. Okay, so here they are. You could probably even get them a little smaller. They don't feel that big on me. This part might be sliding off a little bit. I don't know. I mean, they don't look that big. They are a size kids four. I'm usually a size woman's six. And I don't think they have half sizes. So I feel like if I got these in a size three instead of a size four, they might be too small. Hmm, I'm just trying to kind of play around with them. Let's like walk around and see how they feel. Luna, what do you think of my new slippers? Yeah, they feel fine when I'm walking. They don't really feel like they're about to fall off. So, don't think I will return these for a different size. Thankfully, because I really like these. So happy I got them. Okay, guys, so back to the palette. Let's see what I'm gonna test out here. So, these colors are seriously all so pretty. I'm definitely gonna taste out the, taste out, test out the glitter one and then this pink one and I'll do this orange one and this like mauve purple one. You can see me. I'm on my phone right now. I was kind of too lazy to get my camera out and I think there's only like one bar of battery left anyways. So yeah, I'm using this and then I got my ring light. Okay. Anyways. So I am going to test out the orange one first. The name of the orange one is Beach Scene. Oh, I'm an idiot, you guys. I was talking about the wrong one. So the name of the one I'm going to test out is Sunset View. That's pretty. You know what, I'll test out the very orange one too. It's called Orange Sky. Definitely not as deep of an orange as the other one. And then I'm gonna test out the super pink one. This one. And this one is called Solar Flare. Super nervous for this one. That's pretty. I don't know if you can tell the glitter. Let's do another, another coat. So 
Super pretty. I'm trying to like turn my arm in a good way where you can see it. It's like just looks super awkward. And then I am gonna try out that purple one. It is called Scarlet Blaze. Oh, that looks so pretty. Let's do this. So that is just with like one coat. Clearly, I'm not a professional here. This one also has a little bit of shimmer in it too. It looks super pretty. You can't tell the shimmer. I have my ring light on, but like, I still don't think you guys can really tell. And then, best for last, I just want to wipe my finger off a little. Hold on. Best for last, I'm going to do the yellow glitter. And then the name of the yellow glitter one is Sunburst. Right? Yes, Sunburst. Here it is. Ooh. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, it kind of has some of the pink on it. Like I said, clearly I am not a professional. That is very pretty. Maybe I'll do it on the back of my head for like a better view. That's really pretty. So there is some like, it looks like yellow and purple flake the specs like i said i'm not a pro i don't know what the heck you call them but there's definitely some yellow and purple in there obviously there's yellow but there is purple i don't know if you can tell i will probably take it on my phone with flash to show you guys and i'll put it on the side right here so you can get a way better view and on the back of my hand anyways you guys that is all the stuff i got online doesn't seem like anything is going to be opening anytime soon so i am tempted to get more stuff online the only thing, the only reason I don't usually shop online is because I am so, so impatient to wait for stuff to ship to me. This took, I want to say a week to ship out, which really isn't that bad. And since nothing is open, isn't nothing is going to open anyways, I might as well just get stuff online. But if this were any other time and stuff was open, I'd just rather go to the store because I don't like waiting for my packages. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you stuck to the end, an extra thank you for you guys. One product I highly recommend you get. Well, I highly recommend you get all of these things. Obviously, I haven't tried out this yet, so I don't really recommend this yet. But I do recommend getting this if you are into these colors. I obviously haven't tried it out on my eyes yet. But, I mean, the colors are just super pretty. And I really do like this yellow glitter. And then this seems like a really good white liner so far. I mean, it's really white. It's not like budging or anything. And then if you fit into kid size, save yourself some money and get the kid size for sure. So yeah, I'm just going to end today's video right here. I think I said this already, but thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, make sure you hit the button down below to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.